Alrighty, hello everyone, and Poston here, and today we are going to talk about Mr. Beast, specifically a tweet from Mr. Beast saying, Sometimes I wish I did easy videos like everyone else. And you know what, looking at this tweet, it sounds pretty bad. It sounds kind of rude to other YouTubers, and that's what a lot of people are saying, but I think before we look at this specific part of a tweet, we have to look at the entire thing and a tweet before that. So, with that being said, let's go into it. Okay, so now we're gonna start off with the original tweet stating that we tried to make the world's largest Minecraft mansion and it rained. Then I tried to spend 50 hours stranded in the ocean, but I kept getting seasick and couldn't do it. And then after that, I did a giveaway video, but I didn't like how it turned out. 100% a video next week. So he's just pretty much saying all the videos that he's done, he spent a ton of time, money, put into it, just all failed. He didn't want to upload any of it just because they're not up to his stand because, you know, he says it a lot, Mr. Beast, that he holds his videos to like a really high standard, which is extremely evident when you actually look at his videos. Like, there's a lot of effort put into the editing, the production, and the actual content of the video itself. So it's not very surprising that there's a lot of videos like this. And he talks a lot about his failures on Twitter too when it comes to videos. Like, this isn't the first time it's happened. This happens more often than we actually get to see. But Mr. Beast follows up saying that it's kind of funny that me and the team just grinded for a month and I spent well over a million dollars and we have nothing to show for it. Sometimes I wish I did easy videos like everyone else so this is the tweet that got people a bit riled up for two reasons mainly. The first part being that some people thought that Mr. Beast was flexing when he said that he spent well over a million dollars and has nothing to show for it. Like, oh I just wasted a million dollars just like that. But let's be honest, like if you spent a million dollars and you spent literally weeks of your time working on something and then you have nothing to show for it, like you probably want to vent a little bit and I'm pretty sure that's what Mr. Beast did because he wouldn't make the tweet if it was just to flex. Like, I mean, you know, maybe he would, but that, that really wouldn't make sense in this context. To me, it just looks like he's venting. Like, honestly, again, a ton of money spent, a ton of time spent, and then all for nothing. So uh, that'd be something to get angry about and something you'd kind of want to vent over. And that's kind of what Twitter's made for. But it's this part of the tweet that mainly has some people up in arms because, you know, when you say that I wish I did easy videos like everyone else, that implies that other big YouTubers are making easy videos, low quality videos, and that the videos you make are way better than everyone else's. But I think it would be more fair to actually look at the specific words he uses within this tweet, and that is the word, easy. Easy videos like everyone else. Again, look at easy. Because when it comes to YouTube and other YouTubers, there's probably no other YouTuber that puts as much money, time, and effort into these videos than Mr. Beast. And if you can name a YouTuber like that, uh, you know, put that in the comments, I'm just saying, like, that'd be pretty impressive because I can't think of any other YouTuber that beats Mr. Beast in those three qualities, which makes it the hardest videos on YouTube to make, Mr. Beast videos. You can't beat them, right? And that's what sets him apart from every other YouTuber. It's just the raw amount of effort put into them. And so it's pretty fair to say that I wish I could make easy videos like everyone else because his videos are not easy to make. If we're looking at his main channel, like maybe his Mr. Beast videos, you know, those are videos that are technically done by like a lot of other YouTubers on this platform and some of them do it just as good or even better. So, you know, that's probably not like the best comparison with the gaming channel or the reaction channel, but when it comes to the main channel, definitely. Okay, and that's what he was talking about in his original tweet in his main channel. Those videos are so high effort that he definitely has the right to say that I wish I could make easy videos like everyone else. And it would make sense for him to say it. It doesn't make him unhumble. It doesn't mean anything at all, honestly. It's just stating a fact. Like, the tweet itself is just made for the sake of venting. There's no sort of flexing over here or any superiority trying to be stated here. It's just venting because, again, he put a ton of effort into these videos, a ton of money and, well, got nothing out of it, so he's going on Twitter just to vent about it. There's nothing too deep about it, and, you know, even this video itself is doing a kind of micro-inspection of Mr. Beast and his tweets and all that, and it's also something that you probably shouldn't do just because it's a bit unfair to Mr. Beast, because, again, like, when you're making a tweet, there's not much you can do in terms of, like, tone. It's hard to do that unless you're doing tone in the case, but even then, those aren't enough, so it's really hard to understand what a person means, and since 
he is such a big creator, it's always put under a microscope, and so it's a bit hypocritical of me to say that, but that's kind of just how it is, and there's really not much else can say about that, so that's pretty much it for the video. Uh, if you liked, like. If you want to subscribe, that's even better, but that's it. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.